is it possible for you to share either one or you know some real world applications that are already taking advantage of Akamai for AI workloads? Absolutely. So we have uh, one of our, our customers in the automotive space uh, that's been using the Copilot example in order to provide a better auto shopping experience. So in this case, uh, they're taking their full inventory, the car configurator that Akamai has been delivering using edge computing use cases for years, but now they're applying the knowledge of how people buy from them, the sort of inventory that they're maintaining, including uh, new upcoming models that are available from their, uh, from their pro uh, platform. We're also looking at ways that people can think about different buying options, different insuring options, uh, and then also uh, localized information, like what is the weather like in your area? What has it been like? Do you wanna think about a certain type of vehicle over another, given those types of realities? Uh, we'll take other inputs from users' historical purchases and also apply those. And basically the, the result is a personalized you know, car shopping experience that will provide users with as close to an experience as being in a showroom with somebody who's knowledgeable about autos and inventory, guiding them through a process, but in a way where you know, you're not engaging with somebody who is maybe thinking about their commission or maybe thinking about you know, their preference of a vehicle or their assumptions about you, but instead it's a totally open experience where there's the inventory, there's the user profile information and there are the prompts that you deliver. And then the AI takes care of basically tailoring the rest of that shopping experience to you. Um, we've got other ex uh, examples of it where some of our customers are using AI for uh, computer vision. So trying to understand how they can identify specifics inside of a user generated piece of content that gets uploaded. And then therefore also providing the user with prompts on, you know, we saw this in the image that you uploaded. Would you like to take the next step? There are certain applications in insurance where this is valid when somebody is uploading, for example, an example of damage to a vehicle or damage to a property uh, where you can use computer vision to pick things out in the image and get additional information for a processor. Um, we're also looking at in the social media context of how you can provide the best possible um, uh, recommendations to a user for content. Because again, you'll learn from the user's interaction, but you can also learn from things like parental controls or any sort of regional uh, laws or legislation around the way that content should be surfaced to somebody based on their age, based on their demographic, based on the level of, of subscription that they might have for you. And all of these things are basically extending more static, uh, rigid uh, frameworks that people have developed over time that might reflect human bias and starting to apply that in a, an automated fashion where it's truly based on, on AI and the data that the company maintains and the way that the user chooses to interact in the moment. 